start by setting up the machine for the type of wheel you'll be balancing. The buttons under the display screens indicate the different type of rims. The machine default is a standard wheel. If any lights show another wheel type is selected, press the DS button to clear the menu. The machine is now ready to balance a standard wheel. Start by taking off any old weights that may be on the wheel. Put the wheel onto the spindle. Make sure you have the correct sized cone and slot into the middle of the wheel. Now tighten up the wing nut. The first measurement you'll need is the one between the machine and the rim. Pull out the measuring arm and slide until the edge of the plastic guide touches the inside of the rim. This measurement is 62. Using the up-down disc buttons, enter the figure into the machine. Now use the provided plastic calipers to measure the width of the rim. To do this, push in both arms of the calipers so that they touch each side of the rim. The pointed section at the top of the calipers show a scale. The number where the point lands is your measurement. Using the next set of buttons, enter that measurement into the machine. Now check the rim size. This is a 15 inch rim. So moving along to the next set of buttons, add in this measurement. Close the hood. These numbers indicate that a 20 gram weight needs to be put on the inside of the wheel and a 10 gram weight on the outside. Check that all the LEDs are lit up. Rotate the tyre slightly if necessary. Now attach the 20 gram weight in the 12 o'clock position to the inside of the wheel. Now attach the 10 gram weight. This can be made up of two 5 gram weights as we're using in this example. Again, rotate the tyre so that all the LEDs light up. Now, hammer in the two 5 gram weights in the 12 o'clock position. Close the hood. The reading on the screen indicates we need another 5 gram weight to be put onto the inside of the rim. Close the hood again. Now measure zero, zero. The rule's now been balanced. 